Welcome back to Let's Play Tomba. This is 480 Volts. I think it's time we go kill some evil pigs. Now, um, the, the fortune teller said that red was somewhere very hot. Well, the very first place that comes to my mind is the, uh, fire, the lava caves, but uh, they're kind of hard to uh, navigate right now because of the big old fire. Then she said the, um, the, uh, the, the mansion on the side of the lake, or the mansion on the lake. That makes me think of this place. Well, it is, and uh, I, it's in one of two places, and I can't remember which one it is. It's either the laughing door or it's the crying door, I can't remember. The crying door comes to my mind, so uh, I'm going to go take this mysterious mushroom. Okay, that made him laugh. Now I'm going to use it again. That makes him cry. Let's look in here, see what, what's in here. Oh, wrong, wrong. This is not the place. This is not the place. This is not the place. It is the laughing door. My bad. Couldn't remember. So let's take the mysterious mushroom again. Oh, shut up. Ah, oh, there it is, the green evil pig gate. You would not see this if you don't have the uh, the green evil pig bag. So um, make sure you got your weapon. You're gonna need it. And let's uh, jump up in here. Let's see what happens. Uh, I'm gonna turn it up because I love the evil pig music. My clothes! This happens every time I flex. Who are you? How did you get in? You what? A scrawny thing like you wants to fight me? Well, I guess you didn't see my muscles rip through my clothes. You know, people like you never know what they're getting into before it's too late. What do you think you can do, skinny boy? Go home while you still can. What? You still dare to fight? That's it, I've had enough. I give you a chance. You're in for it now. Just remember, you asked for it. So what he does is he teleports all over the place. If you hit him with your weapon, he teleports somewhere else. Now, if you throw him, it doesn't seem to kill him. And yeah, if you uh, let him alive long enough, he'll uh, he'll he'll do that. He shoots a big uh, flaming ball. Uh, rock at you actually and there's the green evil pig bag in the center of the uh, room our goal is to throw him into the evil pig bag now you have to be somewhat quick okay I missed because if you lock if you jump on him and grab hold of him and if you hold him there too long he'll try to break free but I think I got him yes and yeah as you can see there's lava all over the place because he's the fire pig the lava pig Lava Caves has been cleared. Excellent. Excellent. We, uh, hopefully that put out all the fires of the Lava Caves. All it did was, uh, all it did was break the roof open, I guess, and uh, rain was able to come in. Well, that's great. Um, what else? What else? What else? Uh, I like to heal up. I know, like. He was only like a hop, skip, and a jump away, but I just felt like using this. Alright, uh, so let's see. Now, I could go to the lava caves right now and see if I can find the pink evil pig gate. Uh, I'll do that later. Um, red is awaiting a miracle. Now, what does that mean? Well... Think about it. Search your brain. Who's awaiting a miracle? It's not very clear, 
The answer is Charity Square, because uh, they're waiting the arrival of Charity Fountain. They want Charity Fountain to be fixed. And um, if you talk to them... Yeah, they, they, they want Charity Fountain to be fixed. And um, they kind of pine away about it, so uh, that's... It's not very clear, but that's that's your clue. So I want to go head over to Charity Fount, uh, Charity Square, and see what I can see. This takes forever. Okay, that's fine. Oh no, actually I want to go this way. Here's Charity Square. I think the locals may say some different things too. This is... Well, you already know where this is already, don't you? It seems even Stormy Mountain has been cast under the spell of the evil pigs. There must be an evil pig bag around there somewhere. You need something to revive Charity Fountain. Let's see, what was it now? Inside the 1,000-year-old treasure chest, there's a pig and grapple. I already have it. Reviving Charity Fountain? Oh yeah, I've heard you need some kind of tears or something. Huh. The haunted mansion was, a long time ago, a thieves' hideout. Oh, that's nice. You say anything else? Okay, just seemed like he might say other stuff. Charity Fountain is very popular. Everyone comes to this square. And if you go through the leaf slider and go left at the mushroom forest, you'll reach the ocean. Already been there. Bacchus Village and Bacchus Lake are on the other side of the mushroom forest. Already been there. Uh, nothing here. Alright, before I check up top, um, I want to take a look at... There is a treasure chest. Uh, yeah, that thing right there. First off, is there anybody here? No. Even the lava caves were cast under a spell by the evil pigs. To put out the fires, you'll need to seal the evil pigs. Already done it. Uh, okay, just a crap ton of AP. A long time ago, the 1,000-year-old... One, oh, yeah, that... Yeah, whatever. Have you heard there's a mushroom in the mushroom forest that can make you laugh or cry? I've never seen it, but... That's the one who tells you about the mysterious mushroom. And there's the red evil pig gate. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Oh, come on. Just get me up there. Oh, I almost can reach it. Alright, got it down. Alright, let's see what this is all about. So yeah, the evil pigs, they're, they're your boss fights, basically. And you can fight them in any order you want. Whoa, how did you get here? This area is off limits to all else except me, the stormy evil pig. The one and only master of the storms. It's not a place for little people like you. I take you and your funky hair out of my sight. My storms create havoc for everyone? <laughs> all the better. I do as I please. These great storms are masterpieces. A gold bracelet? Why, yes, gold is beautiful. What's the problem with collecting it? Behold this ferocious storm. I am the ruler here. Don't ever underestimate me. I'll see to it that you understand who's in charge here. Alright, as you can see, the red pig bag is, uh, it, it rotates, you know, one way and then it ends up rotating another way. Do not touch his spikes because they do like more damage than normal spikes do. What does he do? Okay, he causes uh, tornadoes. They, they don't hurt you, they just uh, they, they pick you up and drop you and they can drop you into the spikes. So if you stay like right here, you should be safe. Alright, where is he at? Oh, that's not gonna work. That's bad. Okay, I hit him. Come down here where I can fight you. Uh, 
I remember now, this guy's annoyed. So I almost had him. Ah, oh, I threw him too late. I would have had him. This music's so awesome. Not happening. Like I said, you don't want to hold on to them too long because they'll break free and they'll, they'll hurt you while well, they do so. Too high. Come on, guy. Ah, uh. oh, too late. Oh, you suck. That's gonna hurt. Maybe not. Got him! I think Thomas standing on the spikes, that's okay. Took me long enough. Oh no, he's not standing on the spikes, but okay. Clear Phoenix Mountain! Awesome! done all that, let's take a trip over to Phoenix Mountain, shall we? Uh, I'll use the 1,000 year old bell again. Heal up. It sounds like an old telephone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Excellent. Yeah, now that we've uh, cleared out Phoenix Mountain, there's a lot we can do. Uh, I wonder, there's a couple dudes here and there. Does he say? Yeah, hi, Toma. You always have so much energy. Take care. Hey, do you think you could get the evil pig that cast a spell on this village, too? I like that. I've given up already, but maybe you can find the evil pig. Yeah, once you start getting other evil pigs, they, like, the word gets out. And, uh, they're like, uh, well, if you could get the evil pig that cast a spell on this place, we really would appreciate it. I always like Bacchus Village. They're, they're friendly. I don't, uh, I keep thinking about the guy that has the wants the cheese. I don't have enough. Oh, yes, the music. The music has changed now. It's it's basically the same type of music, it's just happier. So that's nice. Yeah, the place is a whole lot easier to navigate now. Um, and there's an air current right here that'll like carry you through. Oh! You gots to be kidding me. That stupid pump rock got low. Everything went wrong there. I was just saying, there's an air current there that makes... Air current right here that allows you to jump over that area. Alright, kill him. Let's see... Okay, I don't think I can get up there. Ah! There is a chest right up above me, and I'm just... Okay, you know what? Grapple time! I wonder if the grapple can even do this. Not even gonna try it. That chest can, uh, I'll deal with that chest some other time. Now it's a whole lot easier to get over here. Ah!
Uh, that guy still has nothing for me. Ah! There's a chest up there I can get. Maybe. Uh, yeah, I kind of need that. Oh, it's just a couple extra lives. That's fine. I used a few up. Yeah, whatever. Let's go over here. There's what was there was a door that said when the wind dies down. Yeah, I wanna I wanna get that one. Ugh. Lag. back to work. Ah, he moved out of the way. A famous digger, and it is clear. I don't know what triggers him moving out of the way like that. I don't think it's clear in Phoenix Mountain, but yeah, there you go. When that happens, you just run in here and grab you some cheese. Excellent. Ow. Who said you could stand there? And then up here is uh, this door here. This will clear the event when the wind dies down. Woohoo! A large lunchbox. All that for a large lunchbox. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. I actually wanted to do that. Oh, you know what? Let's uh, let's take a shortcut instead of having to deal with that big chasm. Let's go here. No, that's gonna hurt. Yeah, a wind current there. Ah! Who said you could do that? Just fall, Tomba. He's not going to say anything new. That was bad. Let's reload state. Where was I? Oh, you got to be kidding. All the way back here. Right, hang on a minute. Let me redo everything I just did. All right, we're back here, so let's take a nice jump. And uh, actually, you know what? I just realized something. If you jump right here, isn't there a chest? No, or maybe not. Okay, bad idea. So let's just... Ah, I really don't want to get hit too much. There's a chest there. How am I supposed to get to it? Oh, I'm not going to worry about it. Let's go into the lava caves. All right. And I like that a, a, the music, it's the same music. They just added one more track to it. To make it sound even creepier. It's weird. Like, every time you break a spell in a place, usually the music gets happier. But here, like, it gets creepier. It's like you were safer when the lava pit, uh, lava caves were cursed because you couldn't traverse uh, all right let's first things first let's put on our grapple and uh, let's pop up here oh bad idea and uh, this whole area that's pretty much how you navigate this area well, there's a pink evil pig uh, gate right there so let's go ahead and jump in oh I probably should have switched to normal uh, stone boomerang oh well all right, let's take care of the pink evil pig. Ah! Well, what have we here? A funny looking kid with ridiculous hair. The owner of the haunted mansion? Who knows? Who cares? We will the mansion now. You're challenging me to a fight? I'll give you a fight you won't let me forget. All right, let's quickly switch to a stone boomerang. Save. And take this guy on. All right, uh, this guy's tricky because uh, you got three colored platforms: green, copper, and silver. 
Um, he strikes lightning, and uh, wherever you can tell where the lightning's gonna strike. But oh, well, I took of him, took care of him a little quickly now, didn't I? That was easy. All right, I'll explain him in a minute. Don't worry. We cleared the haunted mansion. That was kind of ridiculous. Okay, as I was trying to say, all the platforms are connected, so like, when he strikes lightning on a silver platform, all the silver platforms get electrified, so you need to move away from that. Uh, if he, you know, strikes a green one, all the green ones get electrified, so yeah, just watch out for that. Like I said, I kind of took care of him a little too quickly. You can tell where he's about to strike, though, because right, right before the lightning strikes, the platform it's about to strike starts shimmering, so you know when he's about to strike. Uh, well, we took, we knocked out three evil pigs. We'll do some more exploring. We'll go through the lava caves in the next video. There's some stuff we can do there. Yada, yada, yada. And, uh, yeah, well, join me next time. This is 480 Volts, and I'll see you in my next video.